This is normal Star Wars Empire at War, and this is the realistic one. I am Rebel Admiral Rooster, and I am taking over the galaxy one planet at a time, fighting battles I shouldn't win. I follow this military doctrine, and am always on the run. The goal? To defeat the evil Imperial Admiral Dave. Alright, and welcome back to Empire at War, but it's realistic. This is Admiral Rooster speaking, and I am so excited for this episode because we got a lot of ground that we covered in the previous one. To recap, we got a couple planets from the Empire in the Northeast, Raxus Prime and Jabim. We also kind of defended our planets here at least a little bit putting some fortifications, so that's looking pretty good. Moreover, we also got Eridus, which is a high income planet, which is boosting our income, which is not great, but eh, it's helping out. On top of that, for the Rebel Alliance, we also have Ryloth, which is still chilling, making a lot of money though. Um, the asteroid field, Vergesso Asteroids, which I didn't notice, but we actually got a hero in the last episode from this, because we were very aggressive and took out Solist. And then we're also poised to take out Iriadu. So, we've got a lot of ground that we can cover, and that we have covered previously, so we gotta kinda continue this momentum. First of all though, let's check out our battle agenda. So, like I said, we have the liberation of Iriadu. Right, we don't take over planets. We liberate them, per a commenter, on the last episode. Um, so we've got that poised, or going to happen pretty soon. We also have space defense, which I think we're already working on for Y-Wing bombers. Yeah, I think we're doing that on Mon Cala. And then we also have the most pertinent mission, which is Taurus. We'll get four Corellian Corvettes, which, yeah, it's okay. But um, that's a planet that we should take over soon because this is started week 29. We have 15 weeks. That's 44. Week 44, we are at week 37. So that's quite pertinent. So in terms of the highest priority agenda, or highest priority, not agenda, but option, is um, we got to go for Taurus. So I'm going to move. Oh, gosh. Do I have money? No, I don't. I do not have money. We got to get... We need something on the ground at Sullust. I don't want to lose it. So let's see what I can do here. Hang on. Hang on. I might have to leave some of our guys at Sullust. Who can I keep at Sullust? Paige, do you think you can defend Sullust alone? Please? <laughs> no, you, you definitely can't. Um, what if I bring this group? Oh, gosh. I feel like we're going to need the Gargantuan... Um, at Taurus, but let me scout it out first. Oh, yeah. Put the Gargantuan on Solace because that's kind of a really important planet. So let's go to Taurus real quick. We got another mission on the agenda. Avaram. Riots on Avaram. Alright, let's uh where the heck is that planet? <laughs> oh, where is that planet? Avaram. I think that was a planet I was looking for last time. Oh, never mind, it's right here. I just moved my guys over too. Gosh, okay. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. So, um, speaking of these Alliance envoys, I was told by a gracious commenter that what I need to do is move the envoys onto planets before actually um, gathering support from them. So, let me show you. Let's see. What is a high credit plant? Like the wheel, Transport right? Ahead. Let's go to the wheel and like go like right Guido. Away. So, we're going to bring the envoys over. Construction complete. Oh, nice. Beautiful. Space defense complete. Now we've got Y-Wings. Excellent, excellent. Um, put these guys here. Look at that. We're developing a little bit of a fleet. Stealthy fleet, that is. I'll just kind of put you guys somewhere like Yavin. I'll handle that. Um, all right. Let's see. Where are we? The wheel, right? So now I can see how much money... Wow. Wow, that's all the wheel makes. That is... Wow, that is sad. <laughs> that is, that's really sad. That's all the wheel makes. Okay. Uh, how about Manan? Mutalist? Oh, what am I doing? Let's turn on all of the things. Shout out to Captain Shack. Now I can see the income much better. Now we got credits from Mutalist. And I can go build some more of these guys. All right. That's looking pretty good. What else we got here? <laughs> so what I think I want to do is I want to build up... I want to start getting ready to build tech, right? That's a very important thing for us. 
Uh, just to kind of keep making the moves that we're doing, you know, to maintain that that level of confidence that we got. We have to make sure that we can. Oh, Mike Ito's doing amazing Profit financially. Wow, <laughs> we're smuggling 667 credits for Mike Ito. I think we're getting taxed though. What? The? I saw it go from 13.99 to 100. So that's a it's quite the loss there. Invasion. But here we go. Let's go take out Tar. I didn't even take a look at it. Okay. Whew. Thank gosh. Just an outpost. Okay. All right. So let's check out the base layout of Taurus. We got, I think we're dropping here. Um, what's our outpost? Outpost is just mostly infantry, a few tanks. We can use the infiltrators to take the tanks. <laughs> I'm thinking. All right. I'm thinking I have two sets of troops. I want snipers on here, and I want them to kind of bait. Oh, no. Mm. Oh, I got an idea. Snipers here, troops defending the snipers here. And then we're going to have our full force kind of push in from the northeast. That'll be kind of the X-Wings probably and um, like Leia or somebody here. Or maybe maybe these guys will have them kind of run over. So Leia plus snipers here, kind of baiting the enemy, and then we'll have agents here taking their tanks, and then we'll have the rest of the group kind of moving in there. Sounds good. Now let's see if it actually works. <laughs> Remember, we want to minimize the amount of troops we lose because us losing troops is way harder. Oh wow, they have the local militia. Us losing troops is way more painful than them losing troops. So let's see what we got here. We have militia. Um, so that means like we're definitely going to have a tougher time. I got snipers. Are you guys... Who... Uh, vehicle thieves. Okay, I'm going to need you eventually. So get me snipers. Going to be fighting right against away. infantry, likely. Uh, and then... Out, standard sir. troops. Alright, let's see what we got. So who are these guys? These are just some civvies. They look like rebels, to be honest. It's kind of offensive that they even decided to go for the Empire. Well, that's okay. That's all right. I'm not hurt. Just hurt a little. Let's get the X-Wings on the ground, then. I want X-Wings on the ground. I, I really want to minimize the amount of losses we have. So, Chewy, your vehicle, Smith, and... Let's stick with that right now. Let's see how well we can do with that. Alright, snipers. Get into position. U-wing's kind of moving in. X-wings, go. Go immediately. Start taking these guys out. Alright. I want honor guards on both sides. Being very honorable. I also want units guarding the honor guards. Meanwhile, I want eyes. Please. All right. What do we got here? Commander, go there. Should we go there? We're going to need your vehicle thieves. There we go. Vehicle thieves. Go there. Good, 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 good. Get down. Don't take too much fire. I don't want any of you... I don't want any of you to get hurt here. This is not... This is not a kind of battle where I want to lose troops, just to militia, especially. Alright, we got turrets online. Good, looks like the X-Wings are a little bit too far engaged here. Hey, 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 watch it, watch it, watch it. Oh, 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 not good, not good. Focus fire on that guy. I see tanks over here. Take that out. We got more tanks there. Ah, not good. Not good. Seems like they didn't take the bait. That's all right. Snipers move around. Vehicle thieves move around. All right. Group up. Group up. I want. I want my X-wings and my U-wing to work in tandem here. Okay. So here's what we got. We've got tanks over here. We've got infantry here. We still have... Oh, we still have a dwelling. 
We still got militia. Let's go take it out. Okay. So the plan is essentially, the plans change per usual. We have infantry and we've got a tank that's kind of tough to take. Uh, da, 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 da. Leia, get over there. Okay. Got a little bit of a situation here in that our troops are getting attacked. Chewy, take a tank, please, to your discretion. And then Tank Thief, take the other one to your discretion. Go in there. And then make sure you... Oh, they're running. Oh, they're running. Sprint forward. All right, go. Should we run? Go back, go back. All right, we got one tank. All right, how are our fighters doing? Just okay. Just okay. Oh, I really want one of these, these ATDPs. They're great anti-tank. Tank destroyers. Oh, look, the snipers are doing their thing. Good job, snipers. Good job. All right. I want you to focus on the infantry, please. If you can, that'd be greatly appreciated. I want to bring up Chewie in the meantime. Are you guys targeting? Are you targeting our own tank? Did I just see that? You are. <laughs> you are. Why? Why are you wasting your abilities on our tank? Oh my gosh. <laughs> you are goofy. Goofy. Oh, did we loot? We took out both ATDPs? Are you kidding me? I looked away for one second. You took him out. Jeez. All right. That's fine. That's fine. We'll just have to deal with it. Um. All right. The north is taken. Let's move south. Come on, everybody. Come on. Move up. They're taking out the infantry up north. We're going to start making moves over here. Interesting. All right, position yourselves accordingly. Sniper, stay put. Troops bring up the rear. Ah, uh ha, -huh, ah, uh -huh. Yep, okay. Where are my guys? All right. Go get them. Go get them, take that tank. All right, hold on. You're going to take some heavy fire. Go, nope, just run through it. Run through it. Muscle up and run. Let's go. Same thing. Where's my other guy? Give me a target. Where's my other one? Come here. Get up here. Come on. We'll need that tank. Meanwhile, one, why don't you coming in? Nice. Get out. Get out of there. Oh, oh, we need that gone. We need that down. Beautiful. These are some extremely heavy, high tonnage bunker turrets. We got to take them out because they can take out our tanks. Look at that. We got a little bit of <laughs> stolen tanks. Beautiful. Looks like the rebels are really, really doing their job. I had a commenter stating that um, I, I should have gone for the Empire since my last season for the realistic Empire at War was me doing the Republic and kind of mixing and matching some Imperial units within. I was thinking about that. I was debating it for a while. Um, but I decided against that in the end because number one, I want to play as the good guys. <laughs> number two, I really want to try out Rebel Sim. And number three, what the commenter stated is that I'm kind of more of a, a specialized kind of individual when it comes to my units. I don't just like sending them en masse. That's kind of Dave's thing. You know, maybe I'll try it out later, but me personally right now, nah, I, I love the fact that every single one of my units is, is very special. I love the idea of, of making sure that, that all of my troops don't get murked. <laughs> I, I like knowing that each, each trooper live matters, you know. I'm not too much of a numbers guy in this game, I'm definitely, although it does seem like it with the amount of troops I have, but, um... I really value these troops' lives. I think it's cool giving each one of them like, a personality. Like this battle group, for instance. You know, imagine the name I could give this little battle group right here. <laughs> I don't really know. I don't really have any idea. Maybe Alpha or Bravo, but uh, that's, that's just cool. Maybe leave a comment suggesting what I should name this if I, if I want just a single stealth stealth group. All right. What do we got here? Is this anti-tank? That is anti-tank. Go get that. Go get that. Good hit. 
Anti-air as well, watch it. Alright, troops. Make sure we don't overextend, but get up there a little bit. I want tanks especially to move up. So X-Wings are actually best at taking out groups of infantry. Their weapons are great. Um, they're very high damage against the infantry in particular. But in terms of tanks, they're only good with their missiles. Their rockets are really good. Besides that, it's just kind of so-so. Right? It's mostly just how much can you fire into a group. Into a, into a single target, right? Alright. Focus on the building. We'll take out the troops. We've got tanks that are good at that. We'll do that well. Suppress them, suppress them. Hit them hard, troops. And move up. Yes, suppress them. <laughs> See, it's cool because I don't think I've lost a single infantry unit this entire battle. It's just, you know, valuing my troops that much. I'm not just sending them in droves, and it's it's more little little cannon, little cannon <laughs> within the the realistic series, right? And look at that, no losses. And we got the Corellian Corvettes. So this is actually not a planet I really want to keep. <laughs> I just gotta be honest. I don't really want to keep this planet. I'll give the CR90s to. Yavin. <laughs> me, me personally, I, I don't really I don't really find the value of this planet. <laughs> Manan's not making much money either. So it seems like these the 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 Empire is not doing great with like specific planets. How about how about Bespin? Bespin's a really good one. Notably. The gas giant. Good. Corellian Gorvette, Riot. Avaram, oh, I gotta take them there, okay. Gonna have to take the battle group Alpha, or whatever the name is that I should use, back there. Um, oh, you know what I really want? I want some artillery. So recently, I, I've just kind of been getting into, uh, to kind of get myself in the mood for the series, I've been looking at a lot of battle, uh, battle scenes for like World War II and stuff. And one of the things that I always kind of am interested in, one of my classmates, he always tells me about it, is, also you can see I'm building up a little battle group here, is the value of artillery. A lot of the effectiveness uh, in ground battles is, or many of the casualties are inflicted because of artillery. And so that, that's kind of interested me a little bit. You know, it's not infantry versus infantry or ground companies or tanks. No, it's artillery. And so... I'd love to be, I'd love to kind of make things a little bit more accurate. Besides that, financially we're doing okay, which means it's time for expansion. We've got Solist on the ground, let's get some troops. We can get Solistins and some standard troops. We need to defend Solist best we can. So let's do that now. Let me get ground troops there so I can grab the Gargantuan as well. We can start moving things around. Let's get some more operatives here as well. Thank you. Yes, I do. Take me to your leader. Let's see. Can I take... I think I can't take these plants. I know they are extremely financially good, but I think I can't for some reason. I, I forgot. I think it's because they're just... We're not at war, so I can't just steal from them. <laughs> All right. Looks like I need an envoy back at Coruscant. He, uh, he just got taken out, so don't worry, buddy. I said we value our troops, but we got to keep hiring homies to make us to make us money moves. <laughs> All right, so I need a base shield generator. Uh-huh. Who can use a shield? I got shutter, landing and bombing runs, and a large air radius around the base. Yeah, you know what? I can do that. I can do that. And the ion cannon. Nah. Uh, I, I think it's great. I think the ion cannon is wonderful. But we can use that cash 
in other places. Tarms actually makes a hefty amount of money, 150% uh, planted income. If the planetary income is 200, that should be about 300 plus 50 credits. So 350. I can do that. The, the real question is, though, can I defend it? <laughs> uh, I'll try. I'll try. This can be another planet where it's just like, come on. Let's see if the Empire can can really muscle up here. So we'll keep our, our infantry, some of the infantry here. And then I want to perform a riot at Avaram. Kind of get that get that show on the road. So troops, I'm going to have you move over to Avaram. See if we can get a riot there. If possible, it'd be good. If not, it is what it is. How much did we get from Coruscant? 353. Coruscant is one of those plants that's just such a good safety. Like you know that Coruscant is going to be good. You know that it's solid. <laughs> Alright, five grand. So, I had a comment that uh, from the last episode that uh, I, I thought it was so funny, so I want to bring it up. Shout out to Michael Song three or three seven thirty three thirty seven thirty three that said so Rooster beat Dave so bad that they switched sides. <laughs> I just I thought that was so funny. I was like, yeah, <laughs> yeah. The last season we we got him so good that bro just could not handle it. He was just. <laughs> I mean, that was, that was, that was very funny. Give me a little smile, a little chuckle, a little chuckle there. Um, okay, 273. That's not as good as I thought it'd be, to be honest. That was not very great. Um, it is what it is. It is what it is. How many, okay, so this, 12 weeks. I have until week 52 to get a shield generator online. That is awful. How dare you. I also want, while we're at it, I need to take out Felucia. Felucia will give us a backdoor entrance to Yavin. And that way we can kind of funnel troops over there. Because I need to bring troops over to Taurus if I am going to defend it. Um, yeah, yeah. If I'm going to do that, I'm going to have to do it stat. And then that way I won't have to worry about Jabim as much. We could, we could defend it with units and then a garrison so I can just kind of make it more of a financial base of operations. Yeah, that sounds, that sounds pretty good, actually. Uh, I just lost an envoy. Oh, Corellia. Okay. All right. That's fine. That's fine. No problem. Do, do. Oh. Let me save. <laughs> Man, am I typing? So, of recent, we've been studying quite extensively for... Oh, hang on, hang on. Let me make sure Solace is good. Uh, da, 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 just, let's just do numbers here at Solace. <laughs> like, it's great having Solacetons, but let's make sure we just got the numbers for this place. They're blockading it already. Recon. Mercana. Ooh, Avaram's got Veers. What's going on? What is so important about Avaram? Huh. Bestman's not making much for them at all. Uh, go to Corellia. Um, alright. Let's see what we got here. I have to take you to... We'll plant it again. Mercana. Mercana. I wish I could see these planets. <laughs> uh, in the new awakening of the rebellion. Solace. Oh, that's why he was trying to... That's why he was prepping for the thing. He was prepping for the assault of Solace. Give me back my money. <laughs> Oh no. We got two heavy trooper pl platoons, four stormtroopers, veers, gunships. Gunships. I don't want to lose Garm. I really don't want to lose Garm. And what are these guys? These guys are ATRTs. So essentially, we've got a whole battle group here 
against my ah, ragtag troops. Uh, that's not. Upgrade. That's not. That could be a, a devastating loss. Us losing the gargantuan. But the only place we can retreat is here. Huh. I got an idea. Okay. Here's the plan. All right, everybody. On me. The defense is simple. Oh, I should have moved the base over, though. I want everybody to defend two lines. We're going to do Thermopylae on this place. So, essentially, I can't. I should have done the map overview, but I'm going to get two different positions to defend. Garm is going to defend the south. All the troops are going to defend north. And so on. We want to... Where's Paige? Paige, buddy, you are not a part of this fight. <laughs> you are leaving. I have my infiltrators too. You are, you are going... You are going here. You are taking this. So essentially we are going to box them in. Two different positions. And then on top of that, I want Veers to be taken out by this snow speeder. Pretty quick. If we do take out Veers, that might be a green light to keep going. But if we can't take him out... That probably means we can't. We can't do it. Um, oh, this is a better position to defend Combat on this security. side. Get over here, everybody. Get over here. We can use this turret in the bunker. All right, all right. Oh, great. There are three positions they can attack. The center, too. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Ah. Switch plans again. Take the center. Take the center. Let's just pray that they don't push in too far. If they do, we're screwed anyway. Okay. You, let's see if we can just kind of cheese the Empire. See if we can take out that ATRT. I don't. Ooh, you're not going to make it. Okay. Nope. Nope, that ATAT -AT did not go. <laughs> Alright. Yikes. Yikes. Go there. How can I serve the Alliance? You go there. Let's go bolster the troops this way. This is our only escape route. That is so awful. Alright. Right there, right there. You guys. Build up this big bunker turret. Riken. Defend both sides. You're our only air unit. Oh, you know what I should have done? Gosh, I'm making so many errors today. What I should have done is get the... Um... The anti-air. So I could have taken out that hero at least. Bare minimum, that's what I should have done. Nope, get out of there. Get out, 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 out. This is not good. <laughs> oh, that's great. All right, we're going to have to retreat. We can't do a full frontal assault against the Empire. This is just not... Mm -mm. We lost Solist. They won. Those gunships, my poor planning. Everything coupled together. We lost it. Fall back. Pull everyone back. Get out. Everyone out. We are leaving. Ah. Oh my gosh. No, we needed Sullust for that Quasar. <laughs> Oh, great. All right. Well, there goes my tech, isn't it? Didn't I just lose my, my Celestin tech? Oh, no. My carriers. <laughs> no. At least we got the hero. Oh, thank goodness. At least we have the hero. And now all of my ground troops are being sent over to the asteroid field. That is not good. That That's a really big loss. Losing Solist. Um, gosh, no. Oh, that's bad. All right. All right, all right. 
No time to weep. Let's keep going. We go, Taurus. <sighs> How's Felucia? Let's see how Felucia is right Upgrade now. Upgrade complete. Are we doing a riot here? Did we do recon? Oh, okay. Pirate rescue. Take a stealth unit to the planet. Wait. Conquer the planet. Malastare. Mercana. Oh, yeah. I was looking for Mercana. Where's Mercana? <laughs> it's in all the green. It's in the green mess. Uh, I'm hoping not. Oh, it's there. Oh, hey. You know what? I'll take that. All right. Troops to Mercana. I'm going to need you there anywhere. I need you to go to Felucia. Meanwhile, I need you... Move over here. Ah. Give me fighter tech. So, I've been told that fighters are invaluable. I would agree. <laughs> I would most certainly agree. We need fighters. That is... Yeah, yeah we need that. Unfortunately, these... Solistons are going to have to retreat for now, or at least stay put. Ah. Gosh, that's course. terrible. That's so terrible. All right. Literally, as soon as we gain something, we had to lose it. That's so sad, my homies. Take from Corellia. Take from those guys. This is what you get, the Empire. This is what you get for taking Solus from me. My Soliston tech. Mission log updated. All right. Oh, man, I take over so many planets. I gotta take out Malastair, I gotta take out Eshin, wait is Eshin, no, no, I'm not going to do that, I'm not going to go to war with the CSA, that is a terrible, that's a, that's a terrible one to go for, are you kidding me right now, <laughs> that is so bad, if I fight any of those planets, I'm gonna go to war with a completely different faction, <laughs> that's ridiculous, why would you even suggest that, where's Malastair, Malastair I think is by Sullust, uh, I was wrong. <laughs> no, it is. Okay. It's right there. Uh-huh. That's fine. Not really. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Things are getting worse. Okay. What is it now? Dathomir. Okay. How's Mercana? What are the... Un Ooh. <laughs> Let me see Felucia real quick because I need... Uh, I need that plan. All right. What do we got? So, we have a lot of stormtroopers. Stormtroopers? Stormtroopers and an outpost. So we got a lot of infantry. Actually, we can take that. Do you have a space station? No, you don't. Oh, we can absolutely do a full frontal assault there. Our first actual battle? Yeah, that, that's doable. 100%. I can do that. Um, I'm like bouncing off the wall right now. I'm trying to figure out like what the heck am I supposed to be doing? I want, I want suppression team. Ooh, wait. If we're going against infantry, I want anti-infantry rockets. Because I already have a set of them. No, I don't. No, I don't. Okay. What was I doing? What was I doing? Felucia we kind of got looking at. We're looking at Felucia. We've got the fleet, the stealth fleet, and then our envoys. I want to check out... Uh, let's Departure check out Red Dilly, take out Katane Moidia. Let's move these units over. I think it's time to take out Felucia as well. Oh. Um, alright. <laughs> Looks like I'm losing Katarn. Good luck, buddy. <laughs> See you if we lose. <laughs> If we lose, it's over. <laughs> oh, my goodness gracious. Uh, gosh. All right. What did I even get from that? Again, I don't even know. All right. Oh, we lost our Coruscant envoy. Okay. Okay. I'm getting distracted here. Let me, let me think for a second. Let me focus up. We've... I, we lost... We lost a lot, but we're going to gain a little bit back, okay? We have a few plants that we have to take over in a timely manner. We've got Malastare, and we have, okay, so just Malastare, actually. We're not going to go to, um, 
we're not going to take Ashen. That's just that, that's just a bad idea. But we're gonna go take oh, Malastare and Felucia. Okay. So I think, yeah, yeah, I think that's the best way to go about this. I need a hero. Take a couple heroes actually. Take him over to Rax's Prime, group up with the fleet. Let's go get Felucia and move over to Yavin. Alright. Getting space tech. Beautiful. Space defense. What do you got for me? A bulk cruiser again. Not great. Not, not great. Um, you know what? Well, hmm. Who needs to be defendable? Yavin, you're kind of an important one for us. Recon successful? Beautiful. We got, like, nothing out of that. Things are moving fast. Alright. So I could get one of the space stations on Yavin. Or I could do it on, like, Raxus. Personally, I think I'd rather have it on a planet that is uh, just generally good for us. <laughs> it's just generally nice to have, frankly. Um, good, we've got a little fighter group here. That is excellent to see. Hiring smuggler. Give me more envoys. I think I'm losing them. Uh, Randilly, you know what? That's pretty good. I'll take a little bit of that. Oh, and then I wanted to take out Bespin as well. In the future. In the future. So, I'm sorry. My mind is quite quite clearly kind of bouncing all over the place. I am <laughs> I am very tired. I was talking about studying for an exam recently. Yeah, pharmacy has gotten especially busy as of recent. It's been extremely exciting. And I, I haven't been able to spend a lot of time with a, a lot of people, you know. Like my girl, for instance, I, I, I feel bad for her because I just want to, I want to spend more time with her and she wants to spend more time with me. And it's just, you know, it's a little bit of a difficult time for, for me. And so I'm trying to make sure that I, I give her as much as I can, you know, that's the beauty of being in love. You want to make sure that you treat them in a way that, oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah. You treat them in a way that they know you care, but then at the same time, you also have to make sure that you're still doing the best you can in every way possible. So that's what we're going to do with Felucia. We're going to do the best we can. If we lose, we lose. But let's see. We brought the new fangled Quasar class fire cruiser. Very exciting. This is our fighter cruiser or our um, fighter carrier. So we're going to kind of sport that. And let's bring in a hammerhead. It seems like they've got something big there, so I don't want to overextend. But I want all of my fighters to kind of move in. We got a full squadron of A-Wings, and then these ones that say F, these are the flight versions, the flight variants, so I think they're cut in half. So instead of having six fighters to a squadron, you have three. But we have two flights, so essentially it's, it's, just, it's just one squad. Just that these guys... Um, with their flight, uh, they're more micromanageable. You know, you can kind of micro them a little more. Alright. Let's kind of move these guys up and at it. Let's see what we got. I don't want to overextend. Ah, it must be a space station. It's huge, and we can't drop any troops here. Alright, everybody. Pull back. Let's get some high tonnage out here. Get the Mon Cala fleet. Coming around. Right away. Alright, looks like they've got their target. Let's bring in some anti-fighter. Beautiful. Okay. While they're occupied, let's go move in. I see something. What is that? Was that a missile? Hold on, I'm, I'm not very aware of what we're actually walking into. <laughs> it's been years since I've played Awakening of the Rebellion, and I've never played this sub-mod, so we could definitely be walking into a trap. Um, 
Not exactly, but most certainly something that we don't want to mess with. So, get out of there. Alright. Alright, I see, I see a little bit of a situation here. I want the ball cruiser to go around. So this ball cruiser is quite the oldie, but it's most certainly a goldie because it's great against fighters. Um, and I don't think I can build them yet. So they're wonderful, but not exactly usable as of currently. We also have the famous CR-90s. Famous model being the Tantive IV. Um, great ship. It's called a Hunter, I believe. It's a Screener Hunter, which means hunting means it can take out other frigates, but is pretty small and tough to target. So it can use its um, heavy laser cannons and I think turbo lasers as well. No, just heavy dual laser cannons and light right laser cannons um, to kind of open up on things that are small like this. Guns See? So it can put out a little bit of damage, but then also kind of tough to hit. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Okay, we're getting tractor beam. Use those engines. Use the engines. Good job. Good job. Now get out of there. It's not your fight. Get the ball cruiser out of there too. I want to bring in our MC-75s. These are our highest tonnage ships as of currently. They are excellent for us. They're mostly torpedo boats with a little bit of, a um, little bit of tankiness, like tank destroyers but with armor. They're great. Now here's our issue. They have bulk cruisers too, which are good against fighters. We can't even use our fighters for the most part as of right now. So we're just going to have to kind of cycle things around. Using our MC-75s to our advantage and then just kind of slowly inching our way forward, taking out their fighters as we go. This thing is scary. This thing is, is kind of, it's just shooting, I don't know what it's shooting right now, MSLs? I have no idea what that is. But whatever it's doing, it's it's definitely putting a number on our shields. All fighters, I want you to guard up our other ships, please. I want heroes coming in to protect the fighters and to guard the rest of the fleet and to bait the enemy. Speaking of baiting the enemy, it seems to have worked. <laughs> Alright, everybody. You, I want you to start siphoning shields into your ability, which is full salvo. Increasing those missiles, and we got some, we got some ball cruisers coming in, broadsiding, left and right. Oh goodness gracious! Bombers, watch out against these ball cruisers. They're not good to fight against. Again, like I said, they're anti-fighter. So, us using fighters against ball cruisers, not a good idea. So we've got something going on back here. The sound design of this mod is amazing. Absolutely excellent. Seems like I lost a unit, unfortunately. Must have been a Corellian Corvette of sorts. And then the Hammerheads, which are found in Rogue One and then also um, Star Wars Rebels, they're also hunters. They're not screeners as of much, as much as the... Uh, Corellian Corvettes, but they can they can fight against fighters a little bit, so we'll use them extensively in this campaign, folks. Very helpful ships. Bring the bulk around. Alright. Let's get two MC-75s moving up. I want you to inch a little bit. A little bit. I want you guys to focus on the space station. These guys are going to help out shortly. Hey. Look at that. Alright. Beautiful, beautiful. Inspire confidence with our troops. Alright, we cleared the skies. Time to allow our fighters to open up. Y-Wings are our tough, tough bombers. Excellent for providing support. Cutlasses, I think, are interceptors. Good against bombers. Um, and Z-95s are just all-around good fighters. Early game. We need X-Wings, which is why I got tech for uh, fighters. <laughs> X-Wings and Y-Wings, my goodness gracious, the backbone of the Rebel Alliance, the most famous ships of the Rebel Alliance. We need them. 
Let's go take out the hull of this space station. Essentially, it damages all the rest of the hard points. Actually, let's take out the shields first. And then if we get the hull, um, that means we take out the entirety of this space station. Look at that. Good. Good, 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 good. I want all guns on this space station, please. Now, I'm curious. I don't know if... Yeah. If these independent factions will retreat. I don't think that's in their code, because I don't know if they can retreat anywhere. I'm here. I'll handle that. What is this? This is just a huge group. Capturable support ship. Oh, interesting. That's a really... Oh, wow! This is a remnant of the Clone Wars. It's, um... Because Felucia was a massive, massive um, campaign in the Clone Wars, wherein there were a lot of different Jedi Generals who were involved. Anakin Skywalker, Plo Koon, um, Obi-Wan was there at one point as well. And so a lot of battles were fought, so there's a lot of remnants of Clone Wars air attack. Such as this guy, the core ship from the Trade Federation. Very cool. Pro Cruiser keep going in too. Uh, don't go through the asteroids though. Alright, you watch out. Okay, keep moving up. You go there. Alright, we've got fighters inbound. Oh my gosh, this is beautiful. It's just like the Clone Wars. Those same weapons. Gosh, I'm such a nerd. Those same guns are from the Clone Wars TV series. So it's just... Ah, it's so beautiful. So reminiscent. The nostalgia of my favorite TV show. Alright. Alright, let's clear up this place. I need all of my A-wings. Get over here as well. We're gonna need your help. Unfortunately, I, uh... <laughs> can't just have Dodonna kind of hanging back, right? I can't have everyone in Dodonna's battle group hanging back. I need, <laughs> I need guns out here. Alright, open fire on this guy. Full salvo him. Take him out as fast as you can. He's returning fire. Never mind, it doesn't matter. Okay, that was just a capturable station. Alright, we'll take it. <laughs> I'll take it. I lost one CR-90. Thank God that mission gave us the ability to go get that back. All right. What do we got? So we got Space Defense XQ Queen that I'm going to be building on Yavin. We have Planetary Control. Nope, not happening. We need to take out Malastare. Is Taurus um, okay? Can I just give you a garrison post and, and kind of be done with it? I hear you need my services. I'll leave you a few troops. I'll leave you a few. Uh, honestly, I kind of need most of these guys. <clears throat> I'll leave you Paige, uh, and, and, and some of these guys. Sure. But, that's the extent right now. That's all I can give you right now, because we gotta move. I wonder if Wayland provides them with a lot of money. Same with Kessel. I'm curious about those two plants in particular. Um... Complete. They seem to be all right. <clears throat> Save again. It's beautiful. All right. Let's see. Let's see what we got. <laughs> That's a good enough ground force for Malister, I'd say. Let's go bring you guys over there. Where's Malister? There. And I think I want to try taking back... I want to try regaining Solace to get... Maybe it's that's foolish. But I really just want... <laughs> I want to go back. Be like, hey! <laughs> We're here. <laughs> We're here again. Um, Alright, so I got Tech 1 for Fighters, which gives me the Ewing Cutlass GR-75. Uh, do I need... Oh, I need a fighter station. Okay, let me go buy that. Let me invest in one of those real quick. I didn't know. Okay. I need that. I could get a hero. 
I will also get a hero. You're, we'll, we'll need you for later. And then let's, let's keep building up this battle group here. I'll need some of you. And then maybe some ground X-Wings as well, actually. Let me get ground X-Wings. Um, just general purpose ground X-Wings would be very effective here. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that'd be good. All right. Tactical battle imminent. Wait, what? Did I send somebody over with Kessel? What the? Oh! <laughs> Why did I do that? <laughs> ah, the Corellian Corvettes were a part of these. I just realized that too. As soon as, as soon as they departed. That's amazing though, that they could just leave. Um with the stealth unit the stealth unit allows them to just go wherever oh my gosh kessel has a space station that gives them an isd not happening We're, we are absolutely not fighting that <laughs> four Corellian corvettes yeah no we're not gonna do that uh i wish you showed me how much money kessel made though that would have been nice i do i do need your services actually i want you to go to kessel again please Alright. Got troops on Malastair. Not bad. This will be... We can do this. How's the layout? Ooh, this might be a little bit of a tight battle. Alright. Hmm. <laughs> okay. That is not at all a tight battle. This is not what I thought. This is completely open combat. Open combat means our greatest bet will be... I want Renegade Squadron on the ground. I want to bring Luke in finally, and I want a tank. Just to start off, that's what I'm thinking, plus snipers. So we've got suppression, we've got tank, we've we got to get Chewie for his ability to take things, and then let's get some air. That's good enough right now. What do we have? Is this money? Are these money bags? Oh, yes they are. Go run over there like there's no tomorrow, because... Oh boy, do we need that. Alright, let's go poke at the enemy right now. Because they have an outpost, right? So they don't have a lot. Let's go poke the enemy right now. Um, just kind of see if we can take this stuff out. What do we have? We've got tanks. Standard tanks. See if you can go take that. I'll get you a U-Wing as well. Meanwhile... Let's move in as a group. Let's take that um, command post. Alright, you guys doing okay? Are you doing okay? Just beeline it over here. I'll make sure you have a U-Wing on hand so we can guard you against some of the tanks. Anything that's giving you too much trouble, kind of help out. Alright, you go over there too, buddy. How are you guys doing? You're doing okay? Good, 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 good. That's what I like to hear. Yes, sir. All right. Yes, Commander. All right. So yeah, this semester has been quite busy. Quite, quite the busy one. Uh, I knew the reason why I really ended the the season um, so calculatedly was I knew the semester would be hard. So I wanted to make sure I got myself that front end time so I could just front load a lot of my work, and, and that was. That was a wise decision, um, ultimately, because my gosh, did things get really crazy. And unfortunately, it's going to get even crazier now because, um, you know, we had to, my friend and I, we were, we've been studying constantly. Like, my girlfriend has been like watching, uh, watching me just work, work and work. And, um, you know, she'll, she'll say like, I'm always working. It's like, it's still not enough um, with the studying and whatnot. And so my friend and I were calculating our grades, and yeah, it's it's going to be a lot to do well in this class. And so because of that, it's it's just, I know what I have to do, I just, I just don't want to do it. But I'm going to have to do it anyway. Like, I'm not going home for spring break. Um, so I'm not, I'm not taking a break. You know, it's just going to be work, because I have to do it. And it's it's just one of those things where you kind of learn in life, you know, sometimes you just gotta go to bite the bullet. You gotta do things you don't want to do to get the things that you do want. And ah, uh, 
That's life, you know. Spring break for me is never, I've never been somebody who's like a big party guy or anything or like travels a lot. It, spring break for me has always been just kind of peace. Being at peace and uh, being with my family. Unfortunately, I won't be able to be with my family this spring break, but I'll try to be at peace. Uh, try to try to study, especially since there won't be new material coming in. I'll try to study as best I can and make sure to get another episode out if I can. Yeah. Where are my X-Wings? Where's the other X-Wing? What are you doing up there? Okay. We've got tanks that are scattered. I don't know where the enemy is exactly. I don't know where the homies went. But they are gone. Where are these guys? What the... Move troops. Get you as command group, control group one. Oh, I see. I see a green here. I don't know where. Probably a single infantryman. Oh, infantry squad. Oh, imagine these poor guys. They look up and they see X-Wings coming in. That is... Oh, that's terrifying. <laughs> they don't even have a chance to surrender. Oh, that's so sad. Oh, my gosh. That is such a shame. Poor homies. Yikes, I... Ah, oh my gosh. <laughs> I just realized this is another planet where it's like we just don't need... You know, we don't... Ooh. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, that's such a shame. The Empire is going to make big money moves. Nope. We are leaving. We're leaving. The Empire is on our tail. And the only thing we can really do is to slow them down. Hmm. I can't fight them. I can't fight Antares. It's only infantry, it's only special ops units which can't fight in conventional warfare against normal stormtroopers. They are anti-armor, but unfortunately that's not going to work. So I'm going to use... Send reinforcements. <laughs> what can I do? Uh, well, thank goodness the planet is, is um, General Riker, you need us, heavy infantry, but no. I, I want... Where is Riken? Riken, buddy! I want everyone who is not a militiaman. I want everyone who's not a militia to get over here, take this command post. We gotta go. We're not gonna be able to defend this place. No. It's just not gonna happen. These turrets were very, very well placed though. That is that's so great. <laughs> I love that. I absolutely love that. Let's bring in those infantrymen. Actually, put you in the pillboxes. You guys can go. <laughs> Riken, I kind of want you to take some pot shots if you can. Everyone else get down. What is this? Is the mercenary recruiter? Yeah. Riken, too much fire. Too much fire. Turn around. Get out of there. Ooh, you took a direct hit from something very anti-tanky. Ooh, 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 Riken, you're about to go. Oh, Lord. Riken's about to die. Riken, don't die. Don't die. Please, buddy, please don't die from the reinforcements. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> no, I lost an infiltrator squad. How? How did I lose them? No, you can't be serious. That's okay. We'll replace him with an officer. <laughs> we'll replace him with an officer. So the Empire is making some big money moves over here, which is very bad. Because um, of that, nope. Nope. No siree. Uh, we building? Did we build anyone 
useful for Felucia. I completely forgot who I had popping up here for Felucia. Da, 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 da. I need I needed standard units. Yeah. Yeah. Yikes. Alright. Well, I think I was planning on these X-Wings being effective for that. So, time to be more aggressive. Let's keep going. Oh, gosh. We are... Wow, we're taking a lot of L's today. My goodness gracious. The Empire is not stopping. We need to go for Bespin. Let's go for Bespin. Build that up. Nebula Let's move for Bespin. Let me see what we can drop off here. Just put in a Bothan... Put in 3PO. <laughs> Let's go. Come on, Chewie. To best bin we go. I hear you need my services. <laughs> yes, I do. I do. Uh, okay. So this is our... Oh, gosh. That was... Those were our ground forces. That's so sad. That is so depressing. Heading out. <laughs> Those were our ground troops that just got displaced. Ugh. How unfortunate. I've got to ban a gas. Mm, you do make a lot of money. Yeah, but I don't think I can defend you space wise. Hmm. <laughs> Stealth troops. Order Let's see how best spins look, and they can give us a lot of money. We need that for best spin. I think it's a cloud planet, so we can't even see what they have in terms of the ground, but I'll make sure to try it. I really should have just made this easier for myself. I should have typed in something, just, <laughs> just a letter or something to save it quicker, but eh, that's all right. So I can make you a supply depot. Hmm. I really don't think we're gonna keep Malastare for very long. Constructing. Like pretty much, this is another planet where we're just gonna use to slow him down. Uh, Corellia, yeah, absolutely. Yep, get some more credits in there. Hiring smuggler. Yeah, I feel as though Corellia is just not gonna be the place for us to to really gain a lot of benefit from. Um, yeah, we won't derive much from them. Come on, people, come on. Okay. Let's see what I can do here. <laughs> we can either... In terms of timing, we can either take on... Bespin or Felucia. I think I want to do Felucia for the ending of this episode. Reason being is, oh, look at that. Hey, look at that. Looks like my, uh... ah, beautiful. We've got a few. The new tech option gave us X-Wings. Excellent. We also have the GR-75, uh, Y-Wings, U-Wings, the whole shebang. Oh, that'll bolster our fleet by a significant margin. I will actually, I wish I had Solace right now. <laughs> Let me, okay, hold on. Take a look at Solist. If we can retake Solist right now, I will put in money just to get the Solist in tech for next time. Because that is so important. Because we can get Quasars, and Quasars are vital for the Rebel Alliance. How's the wheel? Take a peek at the wheel. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. These X-Wings, they're not going to get built in a quick enough fashion. Oh, wait, hold on. Did I just lose Felucia? Oh. Go back. Go back. Go back. Okay, good. Whew. Oh, I have to make a... XQ Queen, too. Uh, Building started. right, right. Mm-hmm. 
Mm-hmm. And then a kyber... No, you can't do that to me. Oh, you cannot do that to me. Why? I can't even see what troops are on Celest right now. Why? Hmm. You know what? Let's go try it out. Let's see Invasion. who's on... Oh, no. <laughs> Heavy infantry, a simple barracks. Oh, hey. Oh, no, we can do this. Wait. Wait, we can do this. Hold on. Pause. Pause. We can do that. Inbound. We can do that very much. Hold on. Pause. We got turrets. We have a turret. An anti-vehicle turret. You gotta be kidding me. Wait, I'm not against this option, actually. Um. Okay. Get Garm on the ground. Get fighters on the ground. And all the infantry get down. Get down. Move the tank up. So it's just infantry that they have. They've got a whole lot of infantry. But I think we can do this, okay? Here's the plan. We've got a whole lot of free units that can fight for us. We use some of the free units to defend Garm. The other ones we kind of send into the, the, the gallows. <laughs> we also have suppression troops. And we have snipers, okay? So if I use our fighters extremely extensively, like a lot, and then I also use all of our suppression, and our snipers, we can take out a lot of infantry just by that. Uh, okay. Okay, everybody. Everyone just get ready. There's going to be a whole lot of infantry coming in. Give me fighters. Okay. Leia, you go there. Go hang out with the the uh, honor guards, please. Honor guards, actually, go chill in here. Um, you'll do well in a bunker. Meanwhile, commander, you go there. Okay, here's the plan. We're gonna use our fighters. We're gonna use them to take it. We're gonna take advantage of the fighters and go heck at squads. What is this? Is this anti-air? Hey, it's not. It's like that. Hello, everybody. Go. That's a whole lot of infantry. A whole lot. I need to watch out. <laughs> Thank goodness they struggle taking out fighters. You need to focus on this bunker turret. This thing is this thing's we do not want it operational. Okay, now focus on the infantry. I just realized that if we destroy this bunker turret, they're gonna try to take out our fighters using a good uh heavy anti-fighter thing. Alright, pull back. Get out. Get out, stay put. Everyone else, your group two, will have suppression on the ground. Yeah, I see him too. Everyone, get down. Snipers pull back. Snipers pull back. You guys pull back. Everybody pull back. Alright. Snipers, get up. Get up. Your advantage is your speed anyway. Get up. It appears that they want a piece of this too. Let's go. Let's make sure they can't get it. Good, 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 good. Look at this, look at this. Snipers, if you get in the bunker, can you shoot them from there? No. Okay. Get up.
How's your line of sight? Can you do anything there? No? Cool. I don't want you up too far. Oh, wait. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness. The, the air did so well. All right, let's let's push in. Speeders, uh, not you. You are not really, not really suited for that. There you go. There you go. Use the tank. Excellent job. I love how layered this thing is with turrets. It's so cool. It has built-in turrets. Kind of firing an e-web, this guy. <laughs> He's really holding the fort best he can. It's very impressive. Let's get this, this snow speeder out of there. Troops, you're, you're fighting at the wrong thing. You're shooting at the wrong thing here. Beautiful job. Good job, everybody. Good job. System control achieved. Okay, how do I... Okay. <laughs> We're here. <laughs> we are literally back to where we started. How do I fight this battle group? Is there a way for me to do that from here? Or do I have to... Um... Oh. oh, I know what to do. Hold on. Uh, da, 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 da. You get on the ground, you get up there, you get on the ground, up there, everyone else, ground. Ground, 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 and let's bring these guys. Hey, 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 hey everybody! <laughs> Look, oh, there was a double whammy! <laughs> Wait! Wait, can I not only take out Solist from the ground, but also take out Solist with its Kyber transport? Don't let it go. Don't let them retreat. Oh, wow, that is a big, big boy. Looks like that was, I don't know what that was, but it's huge. Interdictor. Yeah. All right. What do we got? We got an interdictor, and then we have the transport. All right. Heading to Let's go. Let's see if we can do this. I'll have these Fall cruisers out. kind of come in, get the Millennium Falcon as well. Got a little bit of support there. All right. Leia, pull back. Hello, Kyber Transport. <laughs> We're gonna bring in as many guys as we can. Wait, that's not the. Wait, that's not a Kyber transport. The Kyber transport is here. Ah, oh, goodness. Leia, make sure you get out of there. Luke. Go after the hull. I'm gonna have you use your lucky shot. Wait. Oh no. What is it? Is it this? Ah, it's this! Commander. It's this! Everyone open fire at this! Size Luke. Luke already used this thing. What can I do? Um... Going I guess the, the engines? Engine. Did you use your lucky shot? No, you... I don't know if you did. What? For Going for the what happened to your lucky shot, buddy? You know what? That's alright. That's alright. That's okay. <laughs> we got the Gazanti. Wow, we got 10,000 credits from that. That was extremely lucky. You know, that was... That had to have been one for the ages. <clears throat> one for the ages. My gosh. Excellent job, everybody. Wonderful. Okay. Now let's get Felucia, get the show on the road, and move. Pack it up. Let's get out of here. We got Solist. Let's get its tech. 
Um, oh, wait. Oh, is it that game rules? I have to have the tech at Solist. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. I think the rule is I have to have tech at Solist. Which makes things infinitely harder. <laughs> infinitely harder. I need to have Solist tech there. I can't build it anywhere else but there. What do I get from fighters? I get A wings, I get the Marauder. DP-20, gunboat, small craft, or I could get frigates. Twin blade, dot, 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 nah. We're going heavy fighters. Get some more fighters on the ground. Or get some more fighters in the air, actually. <laughs> All right. And then I'll build up some APCs, please. And finally, some tanks. Proper battle tanks, please. Upgrade space station. Alliance Medium Shipyard at Malastare? Alright. I guess I'll buy tanks later. Because <laughs> I can get a whole capital ship for that. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely I will do that. 100%. Alright. Now let's get the show on the road. Battle of Felucia. Do we have our X-Wings? Yes, we do. I hear you need my services. Yes, I do. Um, the wheel's making very little money. Let's go to Coruscant. Let's go. Go to Keto Nemoidia. Nemoidia. Oh God! How did I even pronounce that? Um, take a few infantrymen to On Felucia. Construction complete. Take the tank Friggin to Felucia. What did we just construct? Ah, nice. Looks like a bulk cruiser. Beautiful. Nice. I'll actually keep that. I'll keep this. Services. Oh, looks like I've I've overused my um, my alliance envoys. Oh man, Kessel's not making anything. Onager, nothing. All right, to Corellia, Katsunimori, or er, no, I mean Katsunimori is not making much either. Man. Well, speaking of Kessel. We'll have to move to Gessel soon. Uh huh. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh, do I want to keep Sullust? <laughs> uh, is it worth keeping Sullust? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I mean, it, it's. Uh. Yeah, we're going to need those Quasars. That's just going to be something important to us. And so let's get the show on the road. Let's do the Battle of Felucia. I need one hero on the ground, bare minimum. Leia, would you be okay with that? I think you would. I'll take Luke as well. Let's go. Bag it up. Let's go. Go into Felucia. Meanwhile, infrastructure... There we go. Some freighters, GR-75 freighters. Yeah, I'll take one uh, for just more income. And once those guys get here, we're going to move on to Felucia. Finish up the battle, call it a day. Not bad. We lost Solist, and then we regained Solist. We lost Taurus. Well, actually, we gained Ta Taurus, and then we lost it. <laughs> it's just a nice tug of war. That's great. That's just great. Truly. One for the ages. Let's see if I can get my APC online before, before everyone else gets here. Oh, beautiful. Now we have an MC-75 to defend Solist. Oh, that's excellent. Good. I will take that. Where is this riot at? Castle. My ground force is mixed with it. Yeah. Transport ready. Oh, what have I done? What have I done? Cover tank is on the ground, sir. All right. Oh, Kyle's back. Hey, hey nice to see you, buddy. Nice to see you. Critical information. Secret space. Secret space station. Oh, is that the Death Star? 
Mmm, mmm, I see. Looks like we've got a, a deathly star. <laughs> Gosh. Oh. Oh, hey, hey, Crix. Crix Medine. Hello. An MC40 destroyer. Absolutely. Oh, nice to see you, Crix Medine. I'll put you in, uh, I'll put you there. You've got a little, little destroyer there. Absolutely, I'll take you. 100%. Oh, no. That was Eshin. Never mind. Oh, that's, that's great that you're with us, Crix. <laughs> Gosh, I sound so disingenuous when saying that. No, I'm, I'm genuinely, I'm serious. It's great that he's with us. Um, to Castle, go start a riot there. Prototype for what? Oh, E-Wings. Oh my gosh, this campaign is moving fast. What is going on here? This is supposed to be a realistic campaign. <laughs> what is this? this is, we're moving really quick. I'm getting E-Wings already. I barely have X-Wings. Who am I bringing? Listed, one of, one of the listed heroes. Mon Mothma or Leia. Okay. All right, I'll do that. Uh, Mon Mothma, please go over to Dak and get us some E-Wings, please. <laughs> Meanwhile, check out Kessel. Okay, great. Great riot, guys. Good job. Excellent work, really. <laughs> nice. All right. Let's get Felucia. Let me get my, get my heroes. We got fighters. Oh, my gosh. Oh my gosh, it's just everything's coming in. I have to take the wheel next now. And how many weeks do I have until then? Uh, yeah, I got until week 78. All right, that's doable. Put you on the ground. <laughs> and now we've got new fighters. That's, that's pretty incredible. Uh, I will add you to our stealth fleet. E-Wings. E-Wings are the the uh, successor to the X-Wings. Fantastic ships. They were shown in Ahsoka as well. Uh, I, I don't think they were shown very well. Or, or, you know, they didn't highlight their effectiveness per se. But they were good ships. Hiring smuggler. And they most certainly can do a lot of damage. Now, I want our stealth fleet to be at Jabim. Just in case we need a defense. Nice, nice. Oh my goodness. Just more things to purchase. More things. And we're at... Oh, we're at max cap for population. Okay. Um, ooh, Naboo's looking pretty spicy. We've got a turbo tank there. I could take Naboo. I very much can take Naboo. Ugh. Huh. Alright. Think about it. I'll think about it. Yeah, Evan, I'm, I'm also thinking about getting you these, the Tabana Gas. Uh, you can get us a lot of income with that, now that we've got a little bit of a defense. Um, you know what? Why don't we do that? And I want to move my normal fleet, move the normal fleet to Yavin. And then let's go take out, wow, I am bouncing around. But let's go take out Felicia. We're going to start with Leia. Leia, get us on the ground. And then afterward, I'm going to use the artillery. Choose your reinforcements. Get us the artillery on the ground. Ooh. Ooh, looks like quite a winding road. Alright, good. Just get the artillery there. Just kind of chill. Enjoy your time, enjoy your stay. We need anti-infantry. <laughs> that was so bad. Alright. Get some soldiers. Let's try out the Mon Cala troops. Why don't we, right? Why don't we? APCs. And T1Bs, which are suited for engaging light armor and infantry. Oh, more suited for light armor and aircraft than infantry. That is a shame. I'll get a tank then. Uh, just to kind of tank against the enemy. <laughs> we'll bring in Chewie as well. Because I don't think there's too much of a dealio with fighters. But 
We'll see shortly. Alright, artillery. I already stay close. Definitely gonna need you. Got fighters as well. Beautiful. Love having extra fighters to take out the infantry for us. Oh, is that an accolade? Oh, that's a rancor. Oh, that's a rancor. Halt the column. Bring in the artillery. Use the tank. Everyone move away from him. Go away from him, he's slow. He is slow, get the X-Wings. Oh no, 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 not the honor guard, no! Everyone leave! Oh my gosh! How can I serve the Alliance? I forgot how freaky Felucia is! On my way, sir. What is it now? I copy. Let's move out. Okay, scout it out for us. Jeez! All right, you guys are team two. You guys help Let's go fight our way there. Let's go. I've got Gosh, that's crazy. Okay. And you're group three. Yes, sir. Yeah. All right, team two. Make your way on here. Fighters, go scout out this way then. Gosh, that's creepy. All right. What do we have here? We're going in. Nothing. Are they grouped up in this top left corner? Plotting course. We've come across enemy oh. Units. What is this? Bunker turret. Rancor. ATDP. Uh, no, you know what? You can, you can fight them yourselves, to be honest. I'm good. Go take out the ATDP yourself. Oh, man, that's a lot of troops, though. Wow. Wow, we! I could not have done this very easily with stealth troops. Mm -mm -mm. No way! No way could I have done that easily. Take point. You go there. APC is almost a little slow back there. All right, fighters. I do want you to actually engage. I want you to start poking at him while we set ourselves up. Speaking of setting up, let's set up a right here. I copy. Let's get this thing moving. And then I want artillery right back here. Alright, what do we got? They seem to be fighting any local fora. Uh, we don't need to be doing that, we need to fight them. Ooh, take out that anti-air. Nice. Go against that. We'll take that out. Use your rockets. Deploy them against the outpost. Meanwhile, set up shop. Standing by. Fighters are doing okay. Good. All right. Everybody, position yourselves here. The artillery will defend you accordingly. Good. Keep the infantry up front. I think when, it, when Commence Ground Assault came out for Awakening of the Rebellion, it made it so the infantry is extremely tanky, uh, while the tanks are, they, they tend to be less so. Are those battle droids? Fire artillery. Okay, I guess you're not in range. Oh, what is this? A bunker turret? That's a bunker turret. Get it out. How are our fighters? Yeah, they're doing okay. Take it out. Use that big gun. Don't make me have to pull back our fighters for that. Good job, rockets. Nice work. APC, don't go too far. Don't overextend yourself now. <laughs> yeah, we got some B2s, but don't worry. We got shields. Thank goodness for that. We don't have to worry about things. Fighters are taking a lot of fire. Their shields are definitely overloaded here. My gosh! Open fire. Come on, guys. Come on. Good. Get out. Get out, get out, get out. Get out. 
Oh, they have infantry that's hiding in here too. Interesting. Okay. Let's move out. Yes, sir. Let's go. I've got Just chill out here for now. All right. Bring everyone in. Position yourselves accordingly. Artillery, you do the same. Oh boy, what do we got? Eh, just a few stormtroopers. Who got absolutely destroyed, my goodness. <laughs> Let me see. How the Mon Cala? These are just civvies, right? <laughs> They're just... <laughs> we just sent civvies into the battle zone. What are we doing? <laughs> what are we doing? Oh my gosh. Defend the command post. We got army troopers trying to take it. <laughs> what are we doing, man? That's so funny. We just bring in the militia. Like, yeah. Yeah, we know. We know you're not good at open combat and whatnot, but, uh, you know, we'll just take it. <laughs> we'll give you a gun. You do what you can. No bother. Come on. They're going to be poking their heads out. Watch out. You don't have shields. Oh, what the? Is that a Sarlacc? Oh, it is. Oh, keep away, keep away, keep away. Oh, here we go. Here we go, we got... Engage, engage. Take one of their tanks, take out their, uh, yeah, take the ATDP. Should we go? Why don't you watch it? Everybody get down, watch out, Garm. Where's the artillery? Where is the artillery? What the? Oh, wow, he's just in it. Okay. Alright, come on, fighters, do what you can. Goodness gracious. Oh gosh, alright. Han, what are you doing, buddy? You're just in it. You're just there. Where's Leia? Leia, we need your shield. Bring up the shield. Woo wee! Oh, good. Good, good, good. Alright. Oh, nice, we just took Felucia. I just realized what we just did. That's another planet. Under our control. You love to hear it. Now we have full access to Yavin. That is amazing. We did a ton in today's episode, folks. Let's just go over that real quick. Let me save this and let's talk about what we just what we just achieved. We created our income. I think we were kind of steady on income, to be honest. But we've gotten tech level two. For fighters now which is crazy we have a consistent basis of income at least we have multiple heroes uh, oh. okay we have multiple heroes that are chilling with us one being Crix Medine who is a part of the spec force group which I don't know what he unlocks does he unlock anything do you unlock anything leads important missions um, no I don't think you unlock anything. But we got him. We also got Affion. Which, he's another guy who we can use uh, as a hero. We finally started using um, the Quasar hero. We actually got Quasars. We got the Quasar planet because we originally lost it. And then regained it. And now we have it plus an MC-75. So that's another, it's another cruiser for us. Um... Wow, that's our fifth one. Jeez Louise. What else? We've taken multiple planets, lost multiple planets. We're defending Yavin now. It seems like to a pretty large extent because we're using Tabana gas. We need that financial kind of security. And things are looking not too shabby. Not too shabby, I must say. I'm, I'm quite satisfied with the way the campaign is going so far. And so we'll see what happens in the next episode. I do want to kind of change things up as I go along. So I'll show you guys a little bit more of that in the next coming days or maybe in a week or two. 
So stay tuned on the channel, folks, because I got I got some things cooking up. And uh, make sure you check out the Discord as well, because that's where we kind of hang out. Uh, you can meet a lot of the great guys, part of the community. It's a wonderful time. Anyway, my name is Cyrus. It's spelled like Cyrus, but not like Sea Rooster. Just take out the terror. Thank you very much for watching, everyone. And I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace.